back to the channel and in this video i'm going to show you the simplest way to complete this lab so first of all just simply log in with your appsheet credentials like this and once you're done with that just simply click on the task number one now just simply scroll down and from here this link just simply open this link in incognito window like this way now just simply wait for a couple of seconds now click on this copy app button like this way now for the application name just simply scroll down and from here just simply copy this name and make sure that you do not copy any extra space just simply copy the name come back over here and replace the name and then click on this copy app button now just simply wait and it's done now if you just simply scroll down and click on this check my progress you will get a score without any issue now for the remaining tasks what you have to do in the description box of this video i will share my telegram link just simply click on that link and then you are able to access this document you can see quick lab gsp 1030 dot file name just simply download this file to a local system and once you're done with that just simply come back over here just simply open the new tab just simply search for the google sheet like this and then click over here now just simply wait and if this blank spreadsheet is open, then just simply click on this green button. Just simply click over here. Now here you can see three spreadsheet is already created for us. So just simply open this ship to spreadsheet. Just simply double click over here. Wait for a second now. Now just simply click on this file, then click on this import and just simply upload the file which you just downloaded from my telegram channel. Like this quick lab GSP 1030. Just simply upload this. Just simply wait. Now here please pay attention from this drop down just simply choose a replace spreadsheet like this and then click on this import data. Now just simply wait and it's done. Now if you just simply come back to the lab instructions and click on the check my progress for the next task you will get a score without any issue. And that's the way we have to complete this lab. I hope you guys like the way I solved this lab. If you still have any doubts please do let me in the comment section. Thanks for watching and have a good day guys.